Thank you guys for watching. This is uh, a continuation of another video that I had. This particular one is on putting UV blast um, pr jig protector on the jig heads that I made um, for the previous video, putting the eyes on those videos, putting the eyes on the jig heads. So enjoy this video. Uh, it's a short one, but very, very informative. Thanks. All right, this brings me to the UV blast. And now the UV blast is this. Um, what I've seen in other videos are people that um, just brush it on. And I don't have a, I mean, I do have a, a, a brush for it, but I use my brushes for, for paint like, like this right here. Um, so I'm just gonna dip it. I dip it and I'm gonna hang it up, let it drip. And the GoPro camera should pick it up. And then I'll um, look at them tomorrow and see how, it, how they turn out. They can drip on this paper, it won't be a big deal. That's what happened in the past. <laughs> okay, all right, so let's go ahead and dip these guys and y'all can see it. Uh, so this one right here was dipped in UV blast. And I mean, I have no idea. I don't even know how you would test it to see if the, if UV ray lights are, are hitting it differently. And we're gonna put the rest of these in UV blast. So I'm just gonna dip it. Mm, I'll dip it real quick, just ahead of it. I think brushing it would be better and I probably will end up brushing it but the ones that I did before they came out okay I just um, stuck something inside that little inside the eye for uh, my string which would be fine something like that where's that other one I had here it is That actually has a piece of lead in there. I have to drill that out, I think. Yep, there's a little piece of lead, but it's fine. All right, that UV blast, it doesn't look too bad, though, you know? It doesn't look too bad at all. Let it drip a little bit. All right, we're going to put that over here. And let it do what, it, do what it's going to do. Here's another one. Oh, there's no eye on this one. I have to do another eye on that one. Let's, I'm going to dip it. shouldn't be dipping the bait keeper because that might mess up the um, the lure going on it. Should be, I sh next time I'm not going to make sure make sure the head only only the jig head is going to go in the UV blast. All right, here you go. Let it drip, let it drip, let it drip. Uh, all right, here's another one. Are the eyes on those? Yep. All right, this time only the head. That's it, just the head. Just ahead. Let's see. 
three eighths. Now I'm gonna be using these soon. I'm gonna be using these soon because it's starting to warm up and I'm gonna cast these uh, near some piers uh, that's near my house and see if we can get hooks hook up on anything. Maybe shad, maybe um, some blues, maybe some puppy drum or trout or whatever. Whatever will bite the jigs. We'll see. Because if if it really works, this should show up in the um, at night a little bit better than what other everybody else is throwing. So I'll be curious to see. Uh, okay. And then we have this little three eighths. No, this is a eighth ounce. That's five. I think I had six total, but I didn't put eyes on these. I'm not going to worry about that till tomorrow. So there you go, guys. That's um, basically how I put my eyes on. And I have the UV blast on. I'm, um, I'll check them tomorrow. And you can see I'm starting to drip a little bit. And it may affect it a little bit. I don't know if I should wipe it off or not. The little, see that little piece right there? I think I should just let it, I think I should wipe it out. Some of it. Yeah, it's quite a bit or so in there. I don't know, I'm gonna leave it, I'm gonna leave it. I'm gonna leave it alone and just let it go. All right, y'all have a blessed day. Peace out. Oh, where's the camera? There you go, right there. <laughs> Bye. All right, I couldn't end the video like that. So it's the next day. Let's take a look and see how these lures turned out. Okay. All right. So all of these guys were dipped in the UV blast, and I had to actually <laughs> I look. I had to look back because I didn't see UV blast on this side of it during the whole video that you just looked at, and it's right here at the top. So I'm I'm very, very pleased with that. It's supposed to be very, very durable, and they don't look half bad. I can't wait. I'm going to go ahead and mark them so I know these have all been dipped in the, the UV blast, and I'll be using these this year. They don't, they don't look half bad, actually. I'm going to, excuse me, off a little bit, see if it's any clearer. Man, it looks a little bit, a lot better. I'm videotaping with the... <laughs> With the lens, it's all cloudy. No wonder. But anyway, there you go, guys. All right, you guys have a blessed day once again. And uh, we're gonna be on the water soon. I oh, can't wait. I can't wait. Okay. I, I mean, this looks that looks pretty good. I must say that looks pretty good. Anyway, goodbye. <laughs>